3D printing has revolutionized the way people design, build, and innovate. When I joined Dr. Seepersai's research lab two years ago, we had a vision of providing access to 3D printing to all students and faculty at the University of Texas at Austin. My research focused on designing and building an automated 3D printing vending machine that would operate in a public space. We would later call this project the Innovation Station. The first challenge to creating the vending machine was to design an automatic part removal system to enable the printers to progress through a queue of parts autonomously. The automatic part removal system involves research into many aspects of the 3D printer, such as the build plate, rapid cooling, and the sweeper. Standard 3D printing technology requires you to scrape off the part using a spatula at the end of a build. I researched numerous build plate materials and temperatures that would allow the part to remain attached during the build, but also be easily removed afterwards. I selected a heated glass build plate to optimize both variables. After the part is completed, it remains attached to the build plate. To ensure easy part removal, I employed a dual fan cooling system for rapid cooling of both the part and the build plate. The optimal cooling time of 8 minutes allowed any part to reliably detach. Once the part is detached from the build plate, it needs to be ejected from the printer. The sweeper was designed to universally remove any part from the build plate. This enables the printer to progress through the queue without waiting for external input. A web portal was created to allow for remote part submission and maintain the queue of parts. The Innovation Station was launched in September 2014 and has received almost 1,000 submissions by students and faculty. It is currently operating in the tea room of the ETC and is providing free access to 3D printing to the university. Future research involves expanding the range of materials and creating a more robust system.